Hey! Remember a few weeks ago when I had that little snafu with prism lens effects and they ripped me off for some filters and wouldn't refund or replace them? My new friends at Cinepax have graciously provided replacement filters. Where's my glasses? I lost them. Just for those of you that are new here, you'll find that when you come to my channel, I talk a lot of shit. Like for example, ordering lens filters that never show up and then going through the customer service nightmare that that was dealing with prism lens effects a few weeks ago. For those of you that need to catch up, I will link the video right here. <sighs> After that video launched, a few people suggested other alternatives. So I linked up with Cinepax. They actually replaced the lens filters that didn't show up from Prism Lens Effects. So I want to give them a big thank you. I think over the last year, we have been forced to wake up and recognize and really put the time into investigating where our dollars and cents go when we invest into companies, when we see them marketing products that are of interest to us. As freelancers, we're chasing income. COVID put a lot of us out of work. If you're going to be investing in filmmaking and photography equipment, you really need to know what not to spend your money on. I love it when companies like this get behind creators like me that are still small. The clear streak filter is able to provide you with the anamorphic flare look for your footage without the massive price tag that it would cost to even rent an anamorphic lens for the time being. The clear streak filter reacts to lights and gives you long horizontal flares from any highlight or bright point sources, whether it's a flashlight, a practical light in the scene, a studio fixture, or even just the sun. It'll catch and create characteristics that you can only normally see on expensive anamorphic lenses. Unlike the colored filters that this other dickheads company sells, the clear streak filter from Cinepax will actually react to the light that's already in the scene and it creates a more realistic looking anamorphic flare rather than looking like you slap like a filter effect on it. These attach real easily. Most lenses have like a screw on mount in the front for you to attach filters. They come in a variety of sizes. There's a 82, a 72, a 67, a 58. As long as your lens has a filter thread size of 77 millimeters, you won't need an adapter. Otherwise, you can buy step-up rings from Cinepax themselves in the bundles. They're cheaper than Amazon. And just for fun, I'm gonna drop in the scooter video that you've probably seen on my Instagram that I cut for the scooter company that they absolutely loved. So anyway, I don't have a discount code or anything like that. They didn't pay me to do this. They sent me these filters for free, but I will be spending my money in the future. I will be using the filters I got from Cinepax probably on a large number of my projects coming forward. I have some music videos in the works and I cannot wait to use these in a studio. <laughs> so uh, if COVID could just be over and I could just go back to real life. To reality. Can you imagine what some of these will look like? on stage with lasers, I can. <laughs> I appreciate those of you that show up every week, whether I'm talking shit or showing you camera gear or giving you a tutorial. I appreciate the support so much. If you would like to support this channel, you may do so by clicking on the Patreon link in the description below. It helps cover things like the Wi-Fi and helps pay the bills since most of my content no longer gets recommended. My 
content has been too controversial. Anyway, so I'm going to shut the fuck up now and get back to this video that I'm doing because I'm taking off work for my birthday. See y'all next week. I'm Sean Cooper. If you like what I have to say when I come here to run my big fucking mouth, be sure to tap the thumbs up button, hit subscribe, and hit the bell notification icon so you can get notified when I come here to save you some money. God. I'm, I'm, I'm all over the place. My birthday is coming up, and I'm having, like, all the anxiety. I... Oh.